let's VR. This is Amber. You're watching Virtual Reality Gameplay. Today I'm playing Tomb of the Golems on Gear VR. Tomb of the Golems is an action adventure game set in Egyptian ruins. So this is the level select screen and I'm going to select level two. There are six levels in this game. And you, that is your weapon that you're going to use throughout the game. And that's you, or I guess that's me. <laughs> uh, that's my character in this game, the girl with the hat. And that's my pet, the, I guess it's a monkey. And so to aim, you just turn your head and to move your target reticle. And then to fire, you tap the uh, touchpad on the side of the headset or the A button on the controller. And so the object is to shoot all the enemies before your health expires and the hearts at the top of the screen represent health you have left. And so I'm turning around because the enemies in this level are coming from all around you, 360 degrees. So I played standing up, you could also play in a swivel chair. And when you see the pink exclamation point, that means there's enemies behind you, so turn around. You can see the game's really smooth. Graphics are nice. The animation of the enemies is really cool. The music is kind of neat. It gets a little repetitive, the, the music, um, but it really kind of helps set the Egyptian mood. Oh, and here I'm at the boss. So I killed all his minions, and down to defeat the boss, I have to, oh, when I see that jewel, that pink jewel flash, I have to shoot, because that's his weak point. If I hit him any place else, it won't hurt him, but when I see the pink jewel appear, that's where I've got to fire. Oh, and there's two more. Yes. This is Anubis, which you may remember from my other video, Lost Cities, where I played a board game against Anubis. <laughs> but here he is again, and I just defeated him. Yeah. Stage is complete with three stars. The boss battles are pretty neat in this game. And... I've made it to the next level. So there's not much story in this game. There's there's no dialogue. There's no other characters that you talk to. But the basic story is I'm searching, or your character is searching for her uh, brother who was ex who was um, exploring the ruins and disappeared. So she went in to find him, but ran into these enemies who are. Uh, trying to prevent her from going any further. So in this level, you're fighting this Grim Reaper type character, and to defeat him, you have to shoot the flames. You can't shoot him directly, you shoot the flames that are near him, those blue flames. So after doing that, then his weak point, that pink crystal will appear, and then he disappears. Where did he go? <laughs> so you kind of have to look around you, because there's corridors both to your right and to your left. So you just have to look back and forth. Oh, and you can also listen. There's 360 degree audio in this game, so you can kind of listen which side he's on. And there he is. He was on my left, but he's not always on the left. Sometimes he's on the right, kind of alternates. So, yeah, there uh, there's a bit of um, randomness in this game, um, but overall, there's not a ton of replay value. Oh, there's the extra heart. My pet was holding a heart, and if I shoot it, the extra heart. Um, but I was saying that, yeah, there's not a ton of replay value in this game. Once you've kind of played through it, um, you kind of know, you know, the patterns of the, of the enemies. Uh, so yeah, there's, there's a fair amount of content in this game. Um, definitely more than some of the others, but it um, uh, won't take you that long to play through the entire thing. And now I'm trying to find... Oh, there he is! Ah! That was a, a little bit... Maybe not scary in VR, but definitely startling. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely startled me a bit. Um, and I can't shoot him right there. He's just there to kind of frighten you. But now, next time he appears, though, you can shoot him. Where is he? Ah, there he is. Got him. Yeah. Take that, Mr. Grim Reaper man. And I have completed the fourth stage with three stars. And now I can keep advancing to the next level. And that completes my walkthrough of a couple levels of Tomb of the Golems on the Gear VR. You've been watching Let's VR. This is Amber. Subscribe to my channel for more virtual reality gameplay videos.